My mother had been acting very strange. I wish I never found out why. My name is Carlina White and this is my story. I was born in 1987 and grew up in Bridgeport, Connecticut for most of my life. My upbringing was good and I got along great with my mother. After high school my mom and I moved to Atlanta and just a few years later I became pregnant. I couldn't wait to have a baby and was so excited to start this new chapter of my life. One day I went into an office to get health insurance. I knew the upcoming hospital bills would be costly so I wanted to be protected. I handed the workers my birth certificate but oddly enough they said they couldn't take it and that it was forged. I went back home and asked my mother if she had misplaced it or had any other documents. This is when she began acting extremely defensive and weird. As I was growing older I was also noticing that I didn't really look like my mother. So one day I was scrolling through the National Center for Missing Kids and I saw a picture of myself. I was shocked but not completely surprised. I called the hotline and got in contact with my real family to get a DNA test. Surely enough I had been abducted from the hospital when I was less than a month old. The lady who abducted me was sentenced to 10 to 12 years in jail. She is now free. Follow for more stories.